Hey everybody, what's up? So today I am making a piece for a friend. My friend Jesse Kendallbar makes incredible artistic videos, animations, wood burning art, all kinds of really cool marine, marine bio themed art. And uh, she's been using my music, which is incredible. It's an honor, honestly, to have her art paired with my music. So uh, she hit me up last night and was like, hey, do you have some music? I was like, mm, tomorrow afternoon, I will have some stuff for you. So today we are creating music for her movie in, we'll try to shoot for an hour and a half. Uh, I have this chord progression that's been stuck in my head. Um, uh, I love this chord. D major seven. If, uh, so we'll see if we can work that into like a little B soundscape sort of thing for her video. Okay, so first I'm gonna lay down that chord progression probably a few times so it nice so it evens out nicely. Okay, now we're gonna double that and probably pan them left and right. Okay, now that I got the guitar parts down, it's time to add. Strings! So these notes are ones that I was hearing ringing out in the guitar and there's some like overtones and I was like, mm, may as well play those notes. The strings are probably good enough. I'm gonna add, add a ton of reverb and delay so it sounds nice and oceanic and atmospheric. So here's without any reverb. I'll adjust it as I need to. And then I kind of want to add some like reverse sound somewhere in the mix. So I'm going to try reverse delay. I do like how it's sounding in the mix. It's nice and like, ooh, watch it. It's not very close in your ear. It's like part of the ocean, which I like. <laughs> So what you're hearing, uh, it's emulating a, a vintage tape delay. So on old tape delay, you would, it would actually have tape, and you, when you adjusted it, you would hear the artifacts going by, like like you can hear when I'm adjusting it. I think I found a place where I like it. Okay, so we have the strings down here. Uh, they're panned. They're panned so it sounds nice and orchestral. So here's the strings on their own. So that sound of strings in octaves sliding is really popular, the Beatles used it. Uh, a, most rec a more recent album that uses it is the the Lang, K Katie Lang, who is it? So, it's a good sound. It's very trippy, 60s, neat. Okay, there's a plane. Okay, I know this needs a beat of some sort. I don't really have anything, but bubbles would be fine, maybe some clicks, yeah. Now's the time to find, <laughs> to, to put on drums, which I'm terrible at. I'm, I'm not a percussionist. I don't have a lot of experience with beat making, but I'll find something. What actually could work is pizzicatos, because it's pretty percussive and it, it could be cool. I'm gonna do some experimenting. It sounds nice on its own, but it doesn't really stick out much. She 
kind of cool. I think I might record it with the what? What? Let's try that. Why not? You know, my motto. My motto this this month is weird is good. Weird is more good. Get weird. Okay. <laughs> So I'm just messing around with the synth stuff. I mean, like, I know a couple of the controls with synthesizers, but otherwise, I don't. So, <laughs> here's what I have right now. Uh... It's kind of distorting a little bit, huh? There we are. A lot of times in songs, it's like the really tiny effects and transitions that uh, that impress me. So I'm trying to include those now. Okay, I found some drums that might sound okay. So I'll probably, so I'll probably just pepper them in slowly and then fade them out. I did some drums. I got those. Wow, wow. It's essentially there. I think I just maybe want to add like a top line, some solo stuff with violin just to add a final layer to mix it up. Because it's a little bit monotonous, um, but otherwise I think I'm pretty happy with it. It's almost, it's 1.36, so I still have like 25 minutes to get it over to her. You can do a lot in 25 minutes. The symbol kind of sounds like a anchor. Kind of cool, huh? I like it. Now for the final touch, I'm just gonna add some fiddle over the top of it. Basically just improvising. Probably add a lot of reverb and delay. I might do two, two passes at this. And this is just, you know, the final touch. That'll do. And let's do one more around those lines. I think these reflect the seals and all the coral really well. I think we might be done. Let's check it. <laughs> 